Now I'd like to introduce you to MATLAB's fprintf function. This is a handy way of printing formatted text strings. Let's begin very simply, fprintf with a single string delimited by single quotes. You notice that the hello is jammed up against the next command prompt. To solve that, I'll introduce the backslash n as a new line. Let's try something a little bit more complicated. The first digit of, and then I'm using percent %s, that's a example of a formatting operator. So I finish off the string, comma, and then pi, this new string, is going to be inserted in place of that formatting operator. So again, the percent %s was a placeholder for that string. And let me get a little bit additional variation on the formatting operators. The S was a conversion character. F is a conversion character for floats, and D is a conversion character for integers. So I extend my list of values after that formatting string. We have pi the string, pi the number, and then the integer is extracted using floor. And that sentence prints out nicely. Now you might want to, want to take a little more control over the way floating point values are printed. Here I'm restricting it to only two digits after the decimal point. You can control the field width using this value. If you count carefully, we have five characters. Let's try changing that to a larger value. And I'll take out the precision and just say 12 for the field width and then allow the default precision value to be used. Now supposing I wanted to modify my sentence a little bit to say pi's first digit is. Start typing pi's first digit and right away I start to notice that the string or the formatting string is malformed. We see that from the syntax color coding. Now the way we print a single quote actually is to have double um, single quotes in the formatting string. So that works fine there. All right, now imagine that for some reason we wanted to put a percent sign as part of the format string so that we see the percent and it's not mistaken as a formatting operator. So at the moment, percent %d is being interpreted as a formatting operator. Similar technique, we use double percent sign and that prints out a single percent character. Now you can get a lot more information about all the possibilities for fprintf by doing help win fprintf. We see some of the additional so-called escape characters of which backslash n was one. See how we can print single quotes and percent symbols and so on. And if you want to get even more details about the formatting string, see doc fprintf. And as you look around this page, I wanted to draw your attention to this specific link under more about formatting strings. Everything you need to know about the formatting strings is listed right here.